Hey, what's up, all? This is Dragon with Rock 86. Back again for part two of Dead Center, campaign one of Left 4 Dead 2, my first walkthrough. Um, be sure to check out those few people I shouted out in the first video. And let's get started with this one. See, there's the three basic weapons you get the, sil the silenced submachine gun the chrome shotgun, and a regular pistol. And health, of course, I want health. I think I'll keep my handy dandy shotgun. I've always been a more of a shotgun guy. Um, okay, let's go. Now we're out of that, uh, that burning down hotel, and out here. Goodbye. Baseball bat, I already have one. See, these melee weapons are, be are best for close combat because sometimes, like, like I just did, sometimes you can miss the infected and they can get a couple hits in on you before you're actually able to end them. So, I suggest using a baseball bat. That was my bad guys. And that hunter killed me anyway. And a spitter somewhere. And there's a witch somewhere close by. That's never good when there's a witch. Right there's the walking witch like I said. Sometimes she walks, sometimes she sits. In my opinion, she's probably more deadlier when she's standing than when she's sitting. Um, if you would like to see a Left 4 Dead, a nice Left 4 Dead 1 walkthrough, I would check out Psychedelic, Sta uh, Psychedelic Snake because he's real funny, for one. Two, he did a really nice Left 4 Dead 1 walkthrough. And that was a jockey, by the way. A little imp-like bastard that crawls on all fours, jumps on your back, and humps your head until you die. That's a regular submachine gun, which they are actually rare in this game. Because you see the silent submachine gun more than you see the regular one. See, like I said, the acid spitter usually dies after she spits you. Facial. 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 See, like I said, they all run towards the boomer bile you throw in a big massive horde, which will start attacking you once the boomer bile goes bye-bye.
And I just got some more boomer bile. And here's some new weapons. This combat shotgun is one of the best, is the best shotgun in my opinion that you could ever own, and I mean that you could ever have in this game. Um, usually there's a chainsaw or a, a grenade launcher, which is another new weapon. Grenade launcher is pretty awesome too. It's very powerful. And a jockey's going to come face fuck me in a minute. But he got killed. So, denied. And there's a hunter close by. Want that pipe bomb. Alright. Baseball bat, don't need it. And the charger just got me. This is actually a nice opportunity because this gun store has a bunch of the new weapons in it and I will be able to show you all the new stuff, a lot of the new stuff. The grenade launcher I don't think is one of the guns you can get in this gun shop. Alright, let's see what we got here. This is I think is an AK-47. I might be wrong, but I don't know. That, you know, you'll know that M16 right off the bat because that was from the first game and there's this awesome gun I mean I can't remember what it's called exactly it's camo and it's I guess it's more enforced than this AK-47 down here and you get the same shotgun you got from the first game that was your special shotgun in it and there's the combat shotgun which I have that's this uh this is the sniper rifle that's which is new. I mean wait, this ain't new what am I thinking? This hunting rifle is what's new. Both are very nice and I didn't see that before. It tells you at the top what the names of these guns are. This is called a combat rifle, which is pretty nice, and this is called a AK forty seven, so I was right on that. But I think for this, I think I'll go for the combat gun. And you can get lasers for this, which is free. And you can only get it once. But it improves your accuracy. But those are the basic new guns. There's special stuff like grenades in that. But that's about it. And let's do this. This guy, this this fat this fat chubby gun owner, guns shop owner needs some Coca Cola shit, and you have to go into this general store, which is pretty much which is bare in stock, and grab this Coca Cola shit and get back to this guy with it so he can blast a pathway to the mall in this game. 
I don't know how much longer I'm going to be able to do this part because I'm already running a little over 10 minutes on this and I forgot the cola. Which happens very easily because these cock sucking zombies. Beat you with the freaking cola. Care to hear cola's bad for you? Well, I fucking beat you to death with this cola. If these assholes that are called my teammates would help me. Okay. Now. <coughs> and there's a witch down here. And she's walking too. And I got jockey fucked. I'm just running for the safe room so I can end this because I'm getting over the limit. Alright guys, that's it for now. This is Dragon Lord Rock 86 signing out. Catch you all later. Make sure you stay tuned for part 3.